Welcome to Wander Without Wi-Fi, everyone. Today we are at Lake Bronson State Park. We are in the northwest corner of Minnesota. So far north, we can almost see Canada from here. And this state park has a secret. Shh, let's go check it out. If you like what you see, we invite you to hit the subscribe button. Lake Bronson State Park is about six hours northwest of the Twin Cities. We like to wander, so we chose to drive through Detroit Lakes on our way up. Really, the best thing about this park is, you know, it's the lake itself. It's one of the few recreational lakes that up in this part of the state. In the land of 10,000 lakes, the secret of Lake Bronson is it's man-made, and it's the only lake in Kitson County. It was built during the Dust Bowl years because local wells dried up. Workers from the Works Progress Administration, or WPA, erected the dam in the 1930s. That holds back the south branch of the two rivers. The WPA also built a combination water and observation tower, the tallest in Minnesota, by the way, a beach and a bathhouse. It's now a favorite of boaters and fisher folks from Minnesota, North Dakota, and when there isn't a travel ban, Canadians. According to park manager Tim Williamson, the lake is pretty good for fishing. That it has uh, your standard sort of Minnesota fish, walleye, uh, northerns, and, a, and an array of panfish. So when you come out here at any time of the year, uh, you're liable to catch something. We caught up with Grandpa Pete and grandson Colin in the public dock, and they had already caught and released some perch. As to wildlife, we do have plenty of deer. The park itself sits in a transition zone between two different uh, ecosystems. And so you've got the prairie to our west and the aspen woodlands to the east. And so the park is a nice mix of that. We decided to explore the trails to the west and discovered a few park residents in the restored prairie. We were also told that just north of the park, there was an elk herd in Caribou, Minnesota. So we headed out. What we found instead is this really cool Eastern Orthodox Russian church. So we're gonna check that out. Well, it says visitors sign in, so I'm gonna do that. Oh, last folks that signed in here for Denver, Colorado. We didn't find any elk, but we saw some feathered residents. And when we returned back to our campsite, we decided to call it a day with grilled burgers and beans. After dinner and sunset, it was time for stargazing in the Milky Way, and we weren't disappointed. So if you're looking for a place to take your family this summer that combines recreational fun with a little history, head to Lake Bronson State Park. And if you do, you might find yourself sharing a lake and beach with those who really walk on the wild side. Meanwhile, we hope you'll join us on our next adventure as we wander without Wi-Fi.